the city hospital said that Irina Spiridova was brought here to your clinic. Yes, I. Spiridov's family doctor. I insisted on it. And the care here will be much better. And how is she? She was found outside the city in a car and with a head injury. Was there no one else in the car? I don't know. You'd better ask the police. Can I talk to Irina? You know what kind of condition it is in. Understand, my wife has disappeared. She is pregnant, and Irina is the last person she was seen with. Irina, I'm begging you very much, tell me where Luba is. I told you about your call when you said that you were transporting a pregnant girl. I had no choice. My son will die without a donor, and you understand this very well. You took her to the clinic, what happened next, were you attacked, what happened to Luba? She hit me on the head and ran away. And where did it happen? On the way to the clinic? The police know for sure. So what? You can refuse her. Could you? It's savagery to take her by force. I was saving my son, and your Luba almost killed me. He must live, do you hear me? He must live. I understand that the situation is difficult. But please contact Igor. This may be Dima's last chance. A kind soul. The fourth episode. The fever is down, but that doesn't mean you have to jump. We have to do something, we have to look for him. Where to look for it? Let's analyze everything. The woman who threatened the child, where was it? In the house? In the house. Oh no, in the car. We were driving in the car. Then I hit her and ran away. Where was it? In the city. No, I was running through the forest. Did you just run away or did you run somewhere? To someone who could help? I don't remember. Mom, my mom is sick. Yeah. Where is your father? Do you have a father? I think so. Hello, neighbors. Where did you go? We are home. I think you are not visible at all. Where is Soya? She fell ill. And who is that over there? Is he crying? That cat is weird. Zoe will get better and come over, bye. Quiet, baby. Calm down, yeah? You need to be quieter, you understand? The neighbors can hear it on the street and ask. What can I do? He won't take the pacifier. He needs his mother. Think of something. His tummy hurts, right, little one? Our tummy hurts. Stop it. Quiet. We'll go to the city. He needs to see a doctor. Lesha. Yeah, yeah. And you, don't grumble. I understand. If we take him to the hospital, so what? They'll put a pacifier in him if he screams, and that's it. Where did we get this? They were wrapping the kid up. Did you forget? It was as if I had seen her. Many people have them now. Hush, my little one. Hush, my good one. I think Luba wore one of these, remember? But remember, this is a woman's business. Don't yell at me, Lyosha. I was looking at that girl's face, not at her blouse. I was looking for a resemblance to you. What's wrong? I'm tired of it. For 10 years he could not marry me. And here, some daughters. You didn't want to go to the registry office yourself. Do you have any information about Irina? 
Yes, my colleagues responded quickly. Look, the car, the one that was at the scene of the attack, was taken to a special parking lot. They're trying to open a criminal case now. Against Spiridova for kidnapping. No, about the attack on Spiridova. Do you realize what they will ask your wife when they find her? Really? Listen, Spiridova will write a statement about who attacked her, and then... But she wouldn't dare to write a statement against Luba. Let's see. Look, I also asked for a list of what was in the car. A phone that doesn't belong to Spiridova. The brand is written here, and this, the chain is broken, with a wedding ring, with an inscription. Yes, Luba had a phone like that. Wait a minute. The broken chain, the phone left in the car, who attacked whom? Yes, calm down, we'll figure it out. You don't understand. She could have given birth from such stress. Is that why I didn't go to the hospital? Where could she be now? She could be anywhere now. She broke Sverdova's head. She wouldn't touch a fly. Hello, Lesha. Hi, how are you? Yes, it is like a squirrel, you have to run. Is it necessary? Should we look for a criminal or someone who is lost? No, everything seems to be quiet in our neighborhood. Where is it not quiet? Well, did something interesting happen? In the neighboring district, a young girl was dropped off at the hospital. Can you imagine? She was hit by a car, the driver probably brought her there himself. And then he ran away. Where do we look for the bastard now? And her? And what about her? She doesn't remember anything. Not a name, not a surname, nothing. Wow. Yes, listen, she just gave birth and she lost the baby somewhere. Or threw it away. The women are gone. Will they look for the child? But you know, they are waiting for her memory to return. But what are they waiting for, if I were them? I would comb the entire district, all the villages, maybe someone found the child there. Would they look in their neighborhood? Who knows where she was brought to the hospital from? Maybe they will, maybe we should check ours, why are you so interested? What a boring life in our neighborhood! I'd rather have a boring one, listen, I'm going to, hold it like this. Aha, I'll try to start it. There you go. Good, good, good. Aha. All right. Got it? Yes, yes, yes. Take your time. Oh. So how did you like your first walk? Was it great? How do you feel? Does it hurt? You drive me like a little girl. And I didn't teach you the first steps. I taught Luba just recently. Before we know it, time will pass and you'll be driving your grandson. I don't understand why there has been no news for so long. Arsini called. It's like you can feel it. Hello, Igor. Can you come here? Urgently on the first flight. We can't do without you, and if you can, be careful with Nadezda there. I'm waiting. What? Something with Luba? No, 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 no. They took her away. She's in labor. Will you let me go for a few days? I'm with you. I'm feeling better. No way. You're just out of surgery. They won't even let you on the plane. Can you explain to me what happened? Nothing happened. But if you're going to be so nervous, I'm not going anywhere. Because then there is no point in all this. Okay, I won't. That's it. Just go. Nothing bad will happen to me. I'll be right back. Aha. Uh -huh. My children, my children, how good it is that I have you. Hey. 
Hey, young and curious, have you come to visit someone? I found a young man. I'm going to the same place. Where are you going to whom? I don't remember. Did you come to see her or something? Do you know her? Is this a friend of yours? It seems not. Wait! Here, he is interested by Luba. You're here to see Luba, right? Do you know her? No. She has memory loss. She only remembers her name, and we are waiting for someone to come for her. I said no. What if it was the one who ran her down and left her? No way. That's right. You were drawn to the crime scene, weren't you? I just realized it. She looks like my daughter from afar. I thought... No, no, mine lives in the city. Two, what about her? She lost my child or stolen or she got rid of it herself. Who knows, the girl did a lot of work. Ouch. Ouch. Do you remember anything? A man? Another man, a young man, and he is very dear to me. What about this one? And this one has a very familiar face. But I only remember the road and, and we are going somewhere with someone who is going somewhere. This one seems strange to me. Maybe he is somehow connected to this woman. Did he say his name? No, I didn't realize. Spiridenko's being discharged. Petrovna, ready. Spiridenko. Spii read. Dova. Spiridova. Irina. Irina Spiridova. Spiridova Irina. That was the woman's name. That's right. That's right. I remember. Quiet. Let's do this. I'll try to find out carefully, maybe from the investigator, what's going on with this Sviridova. Thanks. You rest for now. Thank you, you are a truly kind soul. Lubat, do you remember anything else? A wedding ring. I had a wedding ring on a chain around my neck. And it said big heart, kind soul, my wedding ring. I found her. Quiet, quiet, shh. This is Luba, Luba's baby. I can't believe it. Are you sure? Do you think that we have girls running around in droves, giving birth and giving up? She's 50 kilometers away. She could have been brought there. The one who hit her, it's good that he didn't leave her on the roadside. That's why she gave birth on the street, why she left him. I don't know. Or not on the street. And the child was taken away from her and thrown here, and Luba was taken away by force. My head is already swelling. No, I'm not giving him anywhere. Not until she tells me why. The police will check the surrounding villages. They will get to ours. Let her. What if Luba was running from someone? From danger? Did she leave her child behind to save him? But from whom? Wait, maybe this man who came with her had something to do with it. Maybe something happened to her mother. Do you have an address for X? The address is available. I wish I could understand. Yes, that's good. Until we figure out what's going on. We'll keep the baby with us.
I can't believe it. Irina has completely lost her mind. She has her own truth. She is saving her son. So now we are going to the clinic to take a donation test. If Luba were with us, she would say the same thing. Why didn't she call me herself? If it was so bad. The illness of loved ones drives many people crazy and then there is anger and resentment. I think she just couldn't get over herself. I'm very sorry that Luba was hurt. We will definitely find her. How can I help you? I've already raised all the people I could. We know where Luba ran away from Irina. So we're going to search until we find her. He's sleeping. I talked to the doctor. I'm going to take the test today. Thank you. How's your mom? Did Luba tell you? Everything is fine. The operation was successful. And Dima is going to be fine too. It will. Did you find Luba? Not yet. Forgive me. For everything. We looked at the cameras at the gas station. One of them showed Sverdova's car driving away and stopping somewhere around here. But the moment Luba left the car, another car blocked her view. So where did she run to? You can run in different directions here. This is where she could have run, here. Yeah, guys, let's go. Okay, you're going to search this forest, right? I'll take this square. Good, then I will go around these villages. Yeah, by the way, Spiridova, she refused to report Luba. My point is you can take your wife's belongings on demand. The phone and the ring. Shank, shank. We have to go. I'm an idiot. What an idiot. Gentlemen's. Gentlemen's. You have an open door. May I come in? Hey, 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 where are you going? Where are you going? Hello. Don't you remember me? You didn't introduce yourself then. My name is Arsini. Luba is not with you. She hasn't been here since the last time we met. No, did you go inside the house? No, Luba is missing. She ran away from a woman who, anyway. There was an unpleasant incident there. And Luba may think that the police are looking for her. Are they looking for me as a criminal? And, and how she disappeared as well. Anyway, I thought if, if she wanted to hide, she would, she would go to you. Why is that? We didn't really become friends then. I just thought maybe you. All right, then stay here and ask my wife, maybe when I was away. I'm sorry. Ah, what is this? It's like coming home. Your wife is not at home and your Luba is not here. Think about it. Why would she come here? Who am I to her? 
And who are you? I still don't understand. Are you her husband or something? Is she going to give birth to you? Yeah, I'm a fool. I left her alone and I'm sorry. Galanisha doesn't have it. I whore. I thought maybe my father had it. But no. So I'll go further to the villages. Yes, of course. You're right. I'll stop by the local police station. Since I'm already here, bye. What? Are we scared? Are we hiding? We go for a walk. Okay. You saw who came. I sent it. Although, I wanted to tell him about the kid first. You weren't home, so I got confused then. And he was right not to say anything. Maybe it was him who offended Luba. She ran away. And he's looking for her. Oh, it looks like. Yeah. He seems to be normal. He's worried about her. Lesha, who knows what's going on between them, eh? Maybe he told Luba to throw the baby away. It doesn't matter. I didn't even take his contact information. You're always pushing me around. Of course it is. Men do stupid things, and women are to blame. Yes, Nadia. Hello, Arsini. What about Luba? Everything is fine. We are waiting. What took you so long? But this is the first labor. It lasts up to a day. Oh, yeah. It took me a long time to give birth to Ihor, too. And Laibaka jumped out at once. Why are you silent? Are you hiding something from me? No, I'm fine. How are you feeling? Everything is fine. As soon as the doctors let me, I'll come to you. Great, good, Nadia. I have to go. If there is any news, I'll let you know. Aha. Uh -huh. I realized a lot of things here. You lie like this under an intravenous trip for days. And you don't know if you will have it tomorrow. And you think about how stupidly you lived. You need to think about the future now. I am to blame. These eternal insults. I behave like an idiot. Yeah, stop talking like that. Who else promised to ruin my wedding? Yes, he promised. So, do you have a bride yet? There will be one for such an event. It's a deal. I'll try not to die before your wedding. How is Luba? Has she given birth yet? No. Do you think this has nothing to do with me? I think that Luba married a good man and she's happy. But I'm not going to get into it. It's just nice to know that I will have a son. That there will be someone left after me. You lost your temper. Pull yourself together. I'm going to your wedding too. Everything will be fine.
Yes. It's a loud story. It's already reached us. Go to your neighbors to the neighborhood. They will tell you everything about her. I have never seen this girl at all. Thanks. All the best to you. Okay. This is the story. Glory to God, glory to God. Everything will be fine. I will help you. Thank you, baby. Take a seat. Soon I will hardly be able to run anymore, but you will get better. Our doctors are better than those in the city, and this is not only because every waiter is used to its own swamp. Colic. Elisa Denisovna. Elisa Denisovna, I am a doctor and I work in a nursing home. My name is Lubo Kulik, and my husband's name is Arsini. We work together. Do you remember? Well done. Yes, I hit Irina. Then I ran through the forest, my stomach was very tight. Everything was like a fog, I don't think I understood anything at all. Yes, yes, next. Childbirth, and no one around, only a field, a forest, the baby was born, then the afterbirth. I chewed the umbilical cord. Think about what happened next. I. I hugged him, we were lying there, I wrapped him in my sweater, then I thought that it would be night soon and I had to go to people. It was very hard to walk. I was afraid that I would drop him and I... I left the baby in the branches. He was sleeping so sweetly. And you? Then I went to the road. To the sign Galenisha, my father lives there. And I ran away from Arena when I saw the sign. So you were moving towards the village, towards your father? Yes. And then that car, oh my god, what have I done? I left the baby there all alone. Hush now, hush, baby. You were in shock, plus a stressful labor, your consciousness was clouded. What are you blaming yourself for? He did not survive, it's been three days. Stop it. We are going to the police now, they will look for the kid, Belenica is our neighborhood. Stop it, Luba, stop it. You hear me, God willing. They'll find him, they found him, we saved him, do you hear me, they saved him. How long have you been waiting for me? Did you fall asleep? I'm sorry. I just haven't slept for three days. I came to you about the girl they found, she might be my wife. I searched in the neighborhood. And they told me to come to you. Ah, so you're looking for a wife? Yes. 
Her name is Luba. Yes, dear Kulik, the future Biryukova, we just got married. Ah, uh, maybe it was her when I interrogated her. She only remembered her first name. And I think she said that she changed her surname. Do you have a photo? Yes, here. It's exactly her. Only now without the belly. Well, let's write it down that your wife is love. And the child, what about her? She didn't have a child with her when she got to the hospital. It was as if she was dropped off and there. I don't know. Wait, where is the child? But who knows? Her memory had been knocked away. Let's go to the hospital, quickly. Don't fuss, citizen. We are on duty, by the way. And my partner took the car. Get in. Let's go on mine. Let's go. Damn him. Are you looking for someone? Ah, uh, tell me. Does Nadia Kulik live in this house with her daughter? We haven't spoken in years, but we used to live here. Yes, still here. Uh -huh. Is Nadia at home now? What kind of apartment do they have? It's the 10th apartment, only her son took her abroad for an operation. Does Nadia have another son? Yes, Ihor, he's a handsome guy. Oh, Luba and Arsini, I think they are. Yes, Lubaga got married. He's a doctor, a wonderful man. But they are almost never at home. And she's in the hospital right now, I guess. Otherwise, you hardly ever see them. Thank you. Can you give me Arsini's phone number? I really need it. Oh, you know, he's not here. But I can find Lubin. Uh -huh. I'm telling you, there is no Elisa Denisovna. And this one is lost. And she was gone. We got in the car together and drove away. Where? How do I know? They don't say. They didn't run away. Are you going to joke or look for her somehow? Call the doctor. Give me the doctor's phone number. Why scream right away? Wait, Mr. Birikov, don't get excited. Consider that we have already found your wife. Moreover, the doctor is with her. The phone is dead. What a shame. At least they could have called the police officer. Where is he? We won't be here long. Are you thirsty? I told you about Arsini. I've never met anyone like him before. He's the only one he's been through so much. He buried his child, God. If something happened to my baby, I'd rather die myself. Luba, Luba, we're waiting for the police officer. Where to? Luba, Luba. Arsini. My dear, my dear, I will never leave you. Do you hear me? I have done so much. Don't worry. No, I lost, I lost everything, our son. We'll find him. I will not forgive myself for this. We will find him, I promise you. Well, there was not a single one found. I would have known, not a single statement. What if they found it but don't report it? You need to check in Galanitsa. I had already been to the village. Had you? Your father. Nothing? 
There is such a territory around the village. Volunteers work there. No, if you can provide your own people, then. But we have three and a half people for five villages. We will go there. Arsini, I'll look for him. Dear, in your condition. Take me there, please. Here. It was here. I hid him in the bark, like in a cradle, not on the ground, my hairpin. I tied it around my shirt, so it wouldn't get entangled. Luba, let's get out of here, please. No, I'll keep looking. He's not here. Let's go, let's go. I will look for it. I will look for. <laughs> you see, we calmed the forest in vain. I found it myself. Yes, but not a child. Wait, maybe everything will be fine. Here, I took it from my colleagues so you wouldn't have to travel in vain. Thanks. Why did you bring me here? We have to go back to search. Luba, you need to rest, rest at home, this is our home, look, I brought you home. I'm not going there without my son. You told me yourself that we would find him, and I will, and if you don't believe me... I believe you, you get some rest, and I'll go look for him, okay? Take me back. At least change your clothes, okay? I'll go on foot. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, please, Luba, please. Oh, Lubaka, you've already given birth. Congratulations, where is the baby? Ah, a man was asking for you. Deep breath, more precisely. He was looking for Nadia. I didn't really understand what he wanted, but Lubin took the phone. He didn't call, did he? A man from the police. No, he didn't. He said he knew Nadine. They haven't talked for a long time. Dead. Here, someone called. Hello? Hello? Yes, it's Luba. You called me. He's over there. He is beautiful. He's a copy of you. <laughs> he looks like my grandfather, too. And he looks like Lyosha. Luba, don't be angry. I understand that maybe they did something wrong with Zoe. We were so confused. You don't find a mushroom like this every day. And I treated the navel bathed it in celandine. My forehead is 25. I have a child myself. And my hands remember everything. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Do you believe, Luba? I immediately realized that he was connected to you. It was no accident. I need to tell my mom. But I had already written. He said we'll get back to you later. Give my best regards to Grandma Nadia there.
What am I now, grandfather or something? Grandpa Leo. <laughs> Why? It sounds good. I'm not the only one who can be a grandmother, Zoya. Kitty. Here you go. Oh, who is it that woke up so beautifully? Ah, oh my good one, sleep a little longer. Mom only has a few paragraphs left. Dad, do you know what we have? He won't let up on the test, unless you and I go there together. Right? Hello. Hello. You look beautiful. Thank you. Can I have a look? Watch, of course. He's funny. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> he looks like you. What did they call him? Alexei. Alexei Arsenyevic. I see. Congratulations. My mom and I are leaving. We sold our house and will live by the sea. The doctors say it's better for me. My mom is there. Can she see her grandson? The same man, he connected us all, a big family, right? Hello. Hello. He's funny. Thank you, Luba. Thank you for everything. And thank you for him too. Don't you hold any grudges, Nadia? Oh, really? We should be thanking you and Zoya. Please don't be mad at me either. You have raised a good daughter. Yes, and what a grandson he turned out to be. The main thing is that he is rich in grandmothers. Really, Nadia, you'll let Grandma Zoya play? Of course. You have such wonderful places there. It's so natural. You can stay there all summer. So come on down, cousin. You are welcome. Yeah, they're coming, they're coming, they're coming. Well, congratulations on Alexei's christening. Daddy, let the godfather hold it. Who is the baptized one? I'm completely confused. What do you mean who? Everyone, of course. The boy will be rich in his family. Yes, we are all family now. We're going, right? We've already already got the lawn covered. Yes. Here, that's it. You're our baby. Oh. Let's go.